I see you here again. Since you're here, let's watch um some more Tower of God. Now look, last video we seen, I showed you the anime and everything. So now I want to show you like the reason why I feel like this will blow up and like what to expect from the anime. You know what I'm saying? The webtoon they had a trailer a long time ago that came out three years ago. Got six million views. So this is one reason why I think the anime they chose this to be anime because obviously it's a lot of interest in the show. You know what I'm saying? Like six million views. People wanted to know what the fuck was this about. So that's what we're going to get into today. Now another thing, the guy high school webtoon trailer has a lot of spoilers. So when you look at this, I'm not gonna spoil you. I might give you little hints here and there, but I just want you to know what you're dropping yourself into. Okay? So let's begin. Now we get out the way. Uh, we're gonna start once I get full screen. All right, let's go. Got my mic. Got our main character, Moral Jin, meditating. You know. For the longest, I thought them was goggles. I did not know that was a hat. Even when I read the webtoon, I did not know that was a hat. So yeah, that hat is very strong. I thought it was a headband for real. Now these two right here, the, the dude with the scar on his head, you know, and the dude with the white hair with the little thing in his eye, not shining gun or running gun or anything like that. But um, like I said before, a lot of characters in this show have a lot of style, so it's like a little style effect. But the major thing about this is um these two characters, the reason why I stopped was because these two characters are very story driven story driven characters that you will see throughout the whole series. Like even if they're not in the story, they have a major role, both of these people. I just want to say they have both a major role in the series. That's all. The God of High School. There go him and his granddad, you know. There go her with a wooden sword. Now, don't sleep on her because you got a wooden sword. She still um hit that ass quick as hell. She didn't knock out anybody with a sword, a gun, no matter what. She's very good with that wooden sword. It's a reason she has a wooden sword. You ever see one of them characters who are so OP, they need like a, like a, like a, like a, what I'm trying to say, like weights on them or something? That wooden sword is like a weight. If she had a real sword, she'd be way more badass. I say that. She's cool though. Cool character. Plus him. The reason I stopped on him is because I want you to know, like, him right there Anytime you see a character who looks sleepy all day in anime, I know y'all know this, he's going to be a badass character. If you can see um, Tower of God, there's one character in there asleep. Bet he badass. I don't know too much about the show, but bet he is badass. Now look, he's one of the main ones, and he's, he's like my top three favorite characters. So yeah. I like him and all the three of them, you know. Not him. He's one of also one of my favorite characters too, you know. But the reason why I like him though, he's very similar to the main character. Like thinking him like a Sonic to a shadow, but just he's not like an anti-hero to Sonic, you know what I'm saying? Or I I won't consider him a hero either. He's just his own person, you know what I'm saying? But he's very strong. He had his story in the show. He's a very plot-driven character too, so you know. That's all I'm gonna say. Now, one thing I want y'all to see. I don't know if y'all caught this. Moral Jin again. Him, right? Now, if you look at the beginning, right, of the trailer, you will see this thing right here. Something that looks similar to that, you know? Now, I'm going to tell you this now. This is the only thing you'll get close to a spoiler, but which isn't really a spoiler. This guy right here, he's evil. See this face? He's evil. See them eyes? I know you can tell he's evil. If you can't tell, I'm sorry for you. But he's evil. Now look at this on the side, right? Even though he got the whole evil look down pack. I just want to take a second and look at the artwork. From him and him. The artwork in this show is pretty cool and the colors really pop. But he's one of my favorite villains right here. For a multitude of reasons. One, he's badass as hell. Once you see in the show when it's get animated, you see how badass he really is. Also, I like his power too. And he's just one of them villains that like I just like his personality, honestly. He's a pretty cool villain. So let's press play. 
you got his granddad again now this attack right here right I want you to pay close attention right here for a second oh dang I probably went up you see this this attack right here is legit big as a mountain if you look over there it's a mountain over there everything a mountain this is just one attack from one character now they might do that later on in the series you don't see none like that in the beginning I'll tell you that much now well 50 50 but it's a character in this show who can use this you know how urza can spam blades and stuff imagine you can, but imagine if she can exp like do that same like i think like dancing sword attack she do but on this level i'm telling you this show has some badass powers and badass action and this character right here his power the power systems on this show are very on some top tier level stuff that's all i'm gonna say i don't want to tell you what time top that was a tongue twister my gosh <laughs> i won't tell you what type of um like power level it is because i will spoil a lot but this one attack right here is very strong you can see and he can spam it too i'm telling you i know now these two i said like i right, press play look at it now look look at his face after he just got hit <laughs> i just wanted to do that one more time he just hit him Beat nigga. <laughs> there you go you see her again and him again She's gonna be a lot of future people white foods for a lot of reasons if you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying All right, I think you get it. Like I said, don't get it twisted Most characters in the show have a lot of plot development and they actually like push the envelope to me when it comes to, like characters like This is a good good around good story and a lot of good characters who get development not most characters aren't one-dimensional even if they seem like it, they, they might come back and show a no whole another side of the character. So, yeah. Then you got him again. Them two. Now these are two of the exec three of the executives right here. Think of them like government Akoski. You know. We got them two. Now you got. I told you about this guy to keep an eye for him. Once this get animated in the anime, I'm telling you, this anime gonna skyrocket so big. I'm like, damn, Mercury, you right? Shit, I know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now let's get back to this part. Look at this. Look, look at the fighting and scrapping they doing. They all fighting this man. Now look, I know y'all. I remember I told you about that one character who I really liked that much. Um, second nigga name right here him right there I'm not wondering cuz it's like trailer make you wonder why is he like he was right there fighting them why is he like now over there helping them you know what I'm saying like I said this story has a lot of deep depth to it even for a trailer you know what i'm saying and i see why this story right here the trailer really make you wonder like what the fuck is going on you know what i'm saying you see one person three people fighting them and everything and then i know he transformed it's like so many things like you know what i'm saying but look and even watch the tower guy anime the um trailer and everything fighting like this right here Happened throughout the whole series. So if you wonder, I don't know how the fighting gonna be. There's no Dragon Ball Super early animation in this. Everything is everything if it's animated right will look top notch. And don't get me wrong, Dragon Ball Z is one of my favorite animes, but the first half, the movies was better. The animation was better. The some of the scenes was straight up trash. You know what I'm saying? This show right here, is, um, I believe, is anime. It's getting developed by um, Mappa, which is a good studio, especially for animation. So I already feel like it's going to blow up. All your AMVs, everything's going to be coming from this. So let's finish this up. I'm going to be done talking. So, yeah. Like I say, he just transformed. Them two fight him and everything. Well, he fights him. So, yeah. I just want to show you a little bit of the trailer, so, you know. My name is, this is Mercury TV, but my name is Supreme Go. So, like, comment, subscribe, and I have more on the way. Way more on the way coming. So, yeah.